friends thanks so much for watching welcome back to my channel and if you are new here thank you so much for clicking on today's video today i'm bringing you a full day of cleaning motivation so if you are getting your house ready before some family or friends come over for the holidays then i hope you grab your to-do list and you tackle it along with me please be sure to hit the like button if you enjoyed this video and if you are new here please consider subscribing before you go i would love to have you and let's go ahead and get started it's going down on christmas actually starting today's cleaning video in my bedroom and I almost never start videos in here but I wanted to shake it up a little bit for you guys and of course my little shadow is following me around she hates the vacuum cleaner so she jumps about five times in this entire clip it's very funny but anyway we're gonna tackle this bedroom here make the bed vacuum and then we're gonna head downstairs I have so many things to do on my to-do list today so I hope that you are cleaning along with me Only you and me. I'll be making few things here in the sink that I need to clean up and then I'm actually going to scrub out the sink and then in just a little bit you're going to see me set my oven for the oven clean setting. I don't do this very often. I actually prefer to do it in the winter because it makes the house so so warm to have the oven clean setting on. So I actually turned my heat off when this was running and it ran for about four hours. I had to open a window too. It just the smell was really bad and it got so hot. So let me know if you guys have any other tricks or solutions for cleaning out your oven besides using the oven clean setting. I'm looking for products or easy things to wipe it out and keep it clean on a regular basis. Let me know what your plans are for Christmas Day down in the comments. I really want to know what you guys are up to. Are you having family or friends over? Are you going somewhere? I know so many people had to cancel their plans this year. It's just such an uncertain time. And I just wanted to let you guys know that my heart goes out to you if you are someone that had to cancel plans with friends or family this year. And I'm giving you a big virtual hug. We are all in this together and we will get through it. I'm going to be tackling a few deep cleaning projects in this video that I have put off for a very long time. And the first one is basically the sides in the front of this oven. I kind of forget to wipe it down. And then later, I'm actually going to clean out this kitchen window here in the kitchen, like the windowsill area. I opened it up because of the oven smell. And oh my gosh, guys, you don't even want to know how many bugs and just absolutely 
gross stuff was in there. So if you are in need of some deep cleaning motivation, then hopefully this is motivating you. So in this video, I used this method degreaser spray like four or five times, so I have to give it a shout out. And I know that I've mentioned it in some of my videos before, but I genuinely love it. If you let it sit for a few minutes on whatever surface is greasy, then when you go to wipe it away, it wipes away so easily. So I used it on the front of the oven, I'm using it on the inside of the microwave, and then I used it in a few other places later in the video. So just a tip, if you're looking for a really good degreaser, then check out the method one. We have our ups and downs, but when there's love, there's always a way. And oh, this time of year, we come together to celebrate. Yes, every time the snow is falling down and it is cold outside, we gather around the fireplace and no one cares about yesterday. Yes, I am on my way. Okay guys, just know that I totally warned you earlier about this next clip, so I'm actually gonna clean out the windowsill area here by my kitchen window and those are pretty much all dead bugs in there, which is really disgusting. <laughs> so I'm just gonna vacuum out what I can um, with the hose on my vacuum cleaner. And then there was a lot of stuff that was very dried on. So I'm again gonna use a spray here just to kind of wet everything down, let it sit for a minute. And then I'm gonna go back in with a paper towel. I did not wanna use one of my microfibers for this. So I just used a paper towel and I just wiped everything away. And thank God <laughs> it got clean because it was really gross and now I want to do this on all of my windows I'm feeling incredibly inspired <laughs> and then I'm also going to deep clean this tray here we usually put our outdoor shoes on it that we use in the yard for yard work Jack keeps uh, like a pair of boots on here I usually keep my boots or uh, yard shoes as well so it was really really dirty so I'm gonna give it a good clean and there's Josie making her appearance of course and then I'm also going to vacuum out the laundry room because her cat litter literally gets all over the place and I usually sweep every single day with a small dustpan but once a week, I really have to go in hardcore with the vacuum cleaner just to get all of this cleaned up. It's white outside And the night is cold Everyone's lighting candles in their homes Yes, it's Christmas 
it's a magic time You can feel it in the air That every child got their hearts filled up with joy Yes, it's Christmas All around All snow is falling down All the colored lights lighting up this town so I'm really mad because I took all of these couch cushions off of the couch and I got some really satisfying shots of me vacuuming the whole thing out and then none of the footage was good so I couldn't use any of it. I'm really disappointed so the only footage that you're going to get is after I have vacuumed everything and I just put like a little bit of Febreze on the couch. I always do that. I always buy the Febreze for specifically for fabric just because I have a pet I try to Febreze some things down especially surfaces that she spent a lot of time on and now I'm just going around and wiping down a few surfaces in some different rooms in the house with my Iowa pine scented multi-surface spray I had finally busted this out the other day and it just smells like Christmas put me right in the Christmas spirit so I'm just gonna wipe down a few things and then we're going to continue moving all around the house it's Christmas Snow is falling down, all the colored lights lighting up this town. And as I walk outside, hear the Christmas choir sing, Merry Christmas to you. So I really wish that they made this multi-surface concentrate in all of the Mrs. Meyer scents that they sell. Unfortunately, they only have them on the Grove Collaborative in like a few different scents and they never have them in the seasonal ones. Let me know if you guys are like me and you want them to come out with these concentrates in all of the seasonal scents because I want my floors to smell like Christmas too. So I think this is the geranium scent or some kind of floral scent that I was using. So not exactly Christmas, but it did the job and I have made a commitment to try and mop my floors a little bit more often just because we're always tracking things in when we're wearing boots and stuff. So I'm just trying to be a little bit more diligent about mopping pretty much every week.
gonna put all of these rugs back in the house where they belong and then put my microfibers in the drawer and that's gonna be it for today's video thank you guys so much for watching if you enjoyed it please don't forget to hit the like button and as always leave me a Christmas tree emoji in the comments that way I can thank you for sticking around all the way till the end of the video and if you are new please consider subscribing before you go I would love to have you join my internet family and I will see you guys again really soon with a brand new video bye guys Thank you.